That siren, known by many from the movie The Purge, was not received well by some living in Crowley. Chris Walty spoke to the chief on his decision to sound the siren as a part of the city's curfew. Crowley Police Chief Jimmy Broussard says he's never seen the purge, but he knows the sound to be an old military siren. Since the alert Thursday night, the department has received mixed messages about their curfew warning to residents. <coughs> Ty Abshire was caught off guard when he heard the purge siren echoing through the streets of Crowley around 9 o'clock Thursday night. It was just crazy. I knew they had the curfew, but nobody was expecting to hear that kind of siren. Police Chief Jimmy Broussard says his intent was never to scare anyone. As we examined it, we didn't want to go through with our regular sirens because we didn't want to create more havoc. And one of the officers who is military approached me and said, well, you know, Chief, there is an old military uh, siren that was used. It was used in the movie Purge, but it's been used for many, many years. And after listening to us, I said, well, it's a more muffled tone. It you know, wouldn't create to me as much havoc. The department has since received more than 500 comments on Facebook questioning why they use the siren and why the curfew is being strictly enforced. It was to remind people that this is a very serious matter. Uh, it's a very serious disease. It's a very serious pandemic going on. I think part of the issue is people are not seeing even if they look at the statistics, it's not real to them. Abshire says he understands the chief's intentions, but says people on Facebook are now going too far. A lot of posts on Facebook saying, oh, I know who I'm going to go kill tonight. Oh, it's your time. Oh, we have it coming. Things like that. Um, so I've just definitely thought a better siren could have been, could have been issued. Our purpose was to let people know, and if they know now, even through this, how dangerous this pandemic is, how dangerous this COVID-19 is, then okay, it was accomplished. Abshire hopes through all of this, people do see the good work first responders are doing to stop the spread of COVID-19. Thank y'all, thank y'all, thank y'all, uh, and continue to do what y'all do and be heroes out on these streets. The chief says moving forward, he doesn't plan to use any sirens for a situation like this. In Crowley, Chris Waltz, KTC TV3.